Well, the Ina Road facility was uh, built in 75 and started up in 77. We are modifying it and expanding it now to be a biological nutrient removal process. It'll, it'll have a capacity of 50 million gallons a day. We had a reliability problem. We had 20 of those mixers on four digesters. We just had a real problem keeping the mixers running on a continuous basis. At one time, I had, on each one of these digesters, I had five mixers. I had a crew of three full-time working on all the mixers all the time. So we were looking for something to reduce all of our costs and increase reliability, and that's why we looked into the linear motion mixer. It's so basic, there's very little that can go wrong with it. It just works with an up and down motion by moving the, the liquid and the solids around and keeping them in the solids in suspension. Now, one guy can come up and do a preventive maintenance on them and we have very, very little trouble with them. We produce a lot of our own electricity here with the methane gas, but we're, we're utilizing it more, a lot more efficiently than we were before. And when we put the linear motion mixer in, we were saving approximately $30,000 a year in electricity per digester and we have four digesters at that time. So that was $120,000 in electricity alone that we saved by going with that linear motion mixing system instead of the rotary. Hopefully it'll be a benefit to the community.